I don't know. I was so confused because I didn't know what was going on. It was about 8 o'clock last night when a family of six and their dog showed up on Rita Garvey's porch on Collins Avenue in West Seneca. The little boy was up bleeding. His chest it was all blood. And she pulled him in the house. He was, he was He's like six years old, a little tiny fella. They all ran there from their home around the corner on Indian Church Road. That's where the father, 31-year-old Corey Cochran, is accused of stabbing his son in the chest. And that was only the beginning. The mother interceded. She fought with the, the husband, was able to take the knife away from the husband. Uh, the husband apparently then gained access to a second knife. Uh, another struggle ensued. She was able to disarm him with the second knife. She ended up stabbing him several times. Then the mother was able to get her four children together and run down the street. The father even followed them to the house around the corner. He just stood there and he was kind of, you know, he just didn't know what was going on. That's what it looked like. But police showed up soon after, arresting him and treating the six-year-old boy. Dalton Cochran is now in stable condition at Women and Children's Hospital. His mother, Rebecca Cochran, was treated and released from ECMC with wounds to her hands. The father, Corey Cochran, is at ECMC with non-life-threatening injuries. It's terrible to hear that families can, you know, be in domestic violence like that, right close to our area like this.